So we're going to start with auto posting and I wanted to back up before we jump into reels and carousels and first talk through some auto posting requirements because there are a lot of nuances around auto posting and they can be super frustrating if you don't understand them or don't understand what you're doing wrong. So I wanted to first kind of list those out for you to make sure that you could easily understand what to do. So auto posting is available for free and paid users on Planoly. Um, so either type of account has access to auto posting, but there's one really important factor is that you have to have an Instagram business account linked to Planoly. This is a requirement from Instagram. So just make sure that you have an Instagram business account in order to be able to auto post. We have a few different eligible content types. So you can auto post single images, single videos, including reels, which we'll talk about today, as well as carousels with images only. We also have a few other features on Planoly that you can use when auto posting images. So you can also tag users, tag your location and auto post your first comment with image auto posting. Again, getting into the nuances. Um, those are not available at this time for carousels, but definitely something we're looking into. Um, location tagging is also available for auto posting reels or videos and images. So. Again, a few nuances there, but there's some different features you can do when you're auto posting, depending on what the content is. I also wanted to mention a few different um, size requirements. So for images, you'll see the four to five ratio and one to one, and then videos four to five to 16 by nine. Um, so just keep that in mind as you're cropping things. We actually have a cropping tool within Planoly you can use to make sure it's the right size for auto posting. And for videos, as of right now, videos can be three to 60 seconds. We know there's been a lot of requests for extending that to 90 seconds. It's something we're working on. It's not live today. So if you are trying to auto post right now, make sure your video is under 60 seconds. But in the future, we will let you know, hopefully soon, we'll be able to extend that to 90 seconds. All right. So auto posting carousels, I'm really excited about this. This is a new feature we just launched. Um, as you'll see, it's as simple as turning on the toggle. Although as you saw from the previous slide, there's a little bit more to making sure you're set up for success there. Um, so yes, the most important thing is once you know everything is right, you turn on that toggle to auto post. Um, you can auto post image carousels with up to 10 images and you can use either our web platform or our mobile app to do that. So I'm going to jump in and share a demo of how to do this. OK, so as you'll see, I have a few different images on my grid. I actually want to merge those together to make a carousel post. So you'll see first I select the images and then I click merge. I can go ahead and start typing my caption if I want to. Um, but in order to actually create the carousel, I will merge and save all these images together. You can also upload content and make it a carousel from the beginning. This is just another way to do that. So as you'll see, I'm kind of filling out all the details for my post. I'm using hashtag manager to add hashtags. I'm choosing a date that I want this post to go live as well as a time. And then I'm making sure my toggles are turned on. When I click save, everything should go through. Give it a second to process. But as you see, I actually have two errors on this one. So um, I'll click on the images. You'll see the little red dot that shows the error. In this case, I didn't have these cropped to the correct size. So you'll see that I clicked on our editing tool. I adjusted the size for these to a four by five so that they can auto be eligible for, for auto posting. There are two images in this case that were not the right size. So I'm going to edit both of those. You can also do really fun things with this tool, like change your filters, add text, et cetera. This is a paid feature, but um, I think it's so valuable because you can do so much with it. So now all of my images should be the correct size for auto posting. I'm going to turn auto posting toggles back on because they turned them off when I didn't have the right sizes. And then I'll click got it, which is saving all of my content. So it'll take a minute to process and save all of your content. And then we're going to triple check that it is set up to auto post. So now I'm going to switch from all of my posts to my scheduled content. And there I see the carousel with that auto post um, airplane. So I know that it is scheduled because I saw the blue S 
And then the auto post airplane showed me that it was scheduled for auto posting. So I shouldn't have to worry about it. It should go live. Everything should be just great. Awesome. Let me jump now to auto posting reels. So um, auto posting reels is something that I wanted to share because it's obviously something everyone has been asking for. We're very excited about it. Similarly here, um, you'll have to turn the toggle on to auto post the reel as well as select the date and time. Two really, really important things that I wanna call out for auto posting reels is that you cannot auto post a specific audio and a cover photo with your reel. So if you want to auto post real content, the way it works is that you would have to upload the video exactly how you want it. Um, but there's a few workarounds that if you have trending audio that you're trying to use or you want to add a cover photo that you can do. So one would be uploading the video into Planoly with the audio already on it. So then you know the audio is there, it's automatically gonna post. Um, if you want to add a cover photo, you could still set your content to auto post and then just go into Instagram after it's live and edit that reel and add the cover photo there. So that's a really easy way to still be able to use the auto post feature if you're going to be busy or can't post at the time you want to. Um, that's a great workaround for that. Um, another option is to not use auto posting and we actually have a notification system so you can add a cover photo um, and then you'll obviously need to add your audio from Instagram once you get there, but we have an option where you can just set a reminder and then the Planoly mobile app will remind you when it's time to post. So that way you can still post on the go from your phone so it doesn't take a lot of time, but you'll be able to actually get everything exactly as you want it um, and Planoly will help you kind of copy and paste all of your information into Instagram. So those are two different ways, depending on what your preference is, um, in order to still be able to potentially use the auto post feature, but edit things in Instagram later, or make sure everything is exactly as you want it when you launch by having everything manually done at that time. All right, so now I'm going to show you quickly how to auto post reels. So in this case, I'm going to actually upload new content. So there's a lot of different sources. I'm going to upload a video from my computer. Once I upload this video, it'll take a second to process. It's going to give me the option to upload it as a reel. So we want to make sure to select the reel option. It's that second box and click continue. And then we'll click the upload button. So now this is in the kind of a draft state and you'll see I hover over where to upload the cover photo if you need to do that. Now I'm gonna click back into my content and start typing in my caption. I can also add hashtags again using our hashtag manager. And then in this case, because it's a video, I am able to um, tag location for auto posting. So I added a location. And now lastly, I'm going to pick an auto post date. So make sure the toggle's turned on. The second one, also share to feed. Want to call this out here. If for some reason you don't want this video to show on your grid, you'll turn that toggle off. So it will still auto post your content, but it won't show on your Instagram grid. It'll just show on your video tab. So we do have the option to hide it. And then you'll see at the end, I checked to make sure again that blue S is scheduled and the airplane is there for auto posting. Awesome. Okay, so those are the two auto posting updates we have. So I'm going to pause for a second and see if there are any questions I can answer. Okay. So, questions so far can you do product tagging? That is something we are working on right now. Um, so I'm hoping soon, um, I don't want to give a specific date, but I would say hopefully in the next month or so we have product tagging available for auto posting if you do have an Instagram shop. So that's really exciting. Um, can you auto post to TikTok? 
We do not have auto posting for TikTok. Again, that is something we're working on. For that use case, you would have to use the reminder notification um, versus having things auto post. But I will say that it is very seamless. Um, you literally, it, it's a notification on your app. You open that, you click on the notification, it opens Planoly and gives you buttons to copy and paste content into TikTok. So that makes it easy. And then that way you still have the ability once you're in TikTok to edit that cover photo. Um, I know there's other editing tools in TikTok that a lot of people take advantage of. So it's still a great way to quickly get that content over, do everything from your phone on the go. Um, so that's really, really helpful. Let's see. Um, okay, let's see. Can you auto post carousels with videos? Unfortunately, today you cannot auto post um, carousels with videos. So you would have to only have images in your carousel. And one thing I forgot to mention, so I want to mention this now. Um, you probably saw that I had the toggles turned on to auto post to Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. One really important call out is that Twitter only allows four images from a carousel to be auto posted. So the first four images from your carousel will go to Twitter. Um, the rest will not make it. So make sure that the first four are the ones you really want on Twitter. Um, and those will be the ones that go. And then on Facebook and Instagram, you'll get all 10 of those if you have 10. Let's see. So can you tag, can you not tag users in the photos for reels or carousels? Unfortunately, no, right now you can only tag users in like static images for auto posting. Um, so an, again, a workaround here would be to go edit your post once it's published and add those tags in Instagram itself. Why can't creator accounts auto post? This is a great question. Um, unfortunately, this is not a restriction on our side. This is something on the Instagram side. So that's just kind of the rules we have to follow. Um, so hopefully in the future that changes, but right now um, it's limited to just business accounts. Can I add music to Reels? Um, great question. So yes, um, there's two ways you could do that. One would be um, uploading the video into Planoly with the video, or sorry, with the music already on it. That way everything's good to go. Another option would be that you, um, you do the manual posting. So you go, to, you get the notification, you copy your video into Instagram from Planoly, add your caption, and then you'll have to add that sound within Instagram itself. So um, there's kind of two ways to approach that, whichever one you prefer, um, either one would work. Um, let's see. Is auto post available for Pinterest? So yes, we do have auto posting available for Pinterest. That's not something we're covering today just because it's not a new feature, but um, you can auto post um, standard pins. So either videos or regular pins, not idea pins today, but um, again, something we hope that Pinterest will give us access to in the future. But for now you can still auto post standard pins for Pinterest. Okay, I know I didn't get to all the questions, but I'm going to keep going. And then hopefully if there's extra time at the end, we can answer in, um, even more questions. So thank you guys so much for all these questions so far.